Hello YouTube. I'm back for another geocaching video. It's actually the same day as the last one. Um, decided to get like 15 in this area. This one's a virtual cache right over here, but when we pulled up and parked, just, yeah, had to... There's just not much to say. Pretty cool, but uh, the cache is going to be over there at that flagpole. Um, Got to answer a couple questions about the plaque, but yeah, this is really cool. Excellent view up here. So anyway. I zoomed the wrong way. So, yeah, we're going to walk over there and get this virtual. I'll show you what's going on when we get there. Pretty cool, though. I guess we didn't drive across that because you would fall in, it looks like. <laughs> Okay, so we're approaching the geocache now. It's called In God's Hands, which I thought was because we we're going to be at a church, but apparently, you know, the flag is at half mass, which I noticed from over there. And it's a September 11th yeah. memorial. It's pretty cool. Um, try to get to where it's not a glare. But. Anyway, um, yeah, so we're going to log this. Here, I'll show you the view from here. Look, look at that train. They had, they cut the train through all those little hills. How crazy is that? The train goes all the way down over there and goes out of the valley that way. That's, anyway, that's really so neat. I'm going to answer the questions about this and uh, we're going to move on. Like I said, there's like 15 other geocaches. There's another virtual over there. I'll probably film the virtual, not the other geocaches. But uh, yeah, we're going to log this. Let's catch you in a minute. Okay, so we're still at that other, that virtual we just shot. And there was another one that said 200 feet away, but it was pointing off of this cliff. Sorry about the sun. And we're like, what the heck? And then look at this. You walk down here, and there's a staircase made out of railroad ties going down around this corner. Trying not to fall while I'm filming. Um, yeah, the, the flag is right up there. But I'm not sure where this geocache is. I'm guessing it's down here in this tree or something. But we're going to go find it. This is pretty crazy. It's called Stars and Stripes. Can't see it, but right up there. Well, yeah, you can. There's the top of the flagpole. I guess if it was all the way up, you'd be able to see it. But we walked all the way down there, down here, came down this, and then had to cross the ditch down there. And then up here, under this tree, uh, there's a suspect area somewhere in here. Uh, what do you reckon they paid to put that house up there? But uh, anyway, so this thing said uh, terrain of two. Um, 
I would have gave it a harder train than two, but whatever. So anyway, we're gonna sign this log, get back up the hill, and go down the road. Catch you in a minute. Okay, so we're at the other virtual. There are what? Oh. Huh. Okay, so we're at the other virtual. Apparently, it's at a disc golf course. Um, they're putting up Christmas lights here, so I probably look like an idiot talking to my camera. But I'll show you what the virtual is. Um, there's this thing here. And then there's flags for all the branches and the POW flag. Of course, the Navy's in the center has its own special pole because, you know, it's all about the Navy. But uh, there's two other geocaches in this park. One is way over there. Um, I guess it's by hole two. And the other one is across the street over there somewhere. So we're just gonna park here, do some walking, and log these other two geocaches. Uh, we've got like eight today so far. So, all right, we're gonna go get those. Okay, that's gonna do it for this video. I don't have much time here. Um, got the virtual cache, the other two in the area, DNFs. Um, so, we're done for today. Hope you enjoyed the video. Watch one of these other videos. Click subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one. Peace! Look at this guy. He's gonna come get me. What are you talking about?